So anybody who's followed our vlogs knows that uh, Eva will be going to Japan. She did mention that in her very last video. This will be the last time that me and her will get a chance to talk to each other. So I hope you guys enjoy the video of us chatting before she leaves. And then I also stalked her in her entire flight. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. Thank you. So uh, I just wanted to point out real quick that this is the life of a LDR couple, especially when you live this far away. Uh, she is basically hyper and wide awake for the day, and I'm sitting in my chair falling asleep. It's pretty much how 90% of our conversations go, and I just want to say to all the LDR couples out there who get frustrated with having your couple fall asleep on you, that's that's just part of um, part of life when it comes to an LDR couple. Especially if you live in such weird time zones and your girlfriend's singing in the background. <laughs> so just uh, bear bear with your couple, whoever you're with. Just, just know that they're trying and that uh, if they fall asleep, which we have both done it to each other. She has done it to me and I've done it to her where we'll be in mid-sentence. And one of us will fall asleep. Uh, just let them stay asleep. Um... <laughs> okay. Anyways, I can't be serious right now because she's doing that. Um, just bear with your partner. Just You just got to understand that you are, in fact, in different time zones. So... Oh, damn it. <laughs> So anyways, yeah, um, <laughs> just bear with your partner. That's the moral of the story. You did that all by yourself, honey. Okay, do it again. They stopped. Oh, you almost got one of them to go. Do it again. If I do it and then you keep going, they'll keep going. <laughs> I'm not mean, that's their natural instinct. Their natural instinct, but it makes them tired, and now they need a treat. Uh, okay, treat. fine. Two. I want a treat. Ooh, that's cool. <laughs> oh, I covered your mouth for you. Thank God they didn't see that. All right. <laughs> Proof that I really did stalk Eva for four and a half hours on Flight Tracker. Because there she is. That's her flight. She's landing in Hong Kong National Airport. International Airport. Right now, I'm stalking her. I've got an alert on my phone that's gonna probably go off telling me she landed because I downloaded the flight tracker app on my phone but there she is she's touching down right now <laughs> actually she's still 700 feet in the well 500 feet in the air 
so she's probably hitting the runway right about now. Yay! She's landing! Woo! Okay. Uh, now I just gotta wait for her next flight to take off. Aww. Uh, it's gonna be uh, a CPA uh, 547 or so, I don't know. I can't remember. But I'm gonna wait for her to take off and then I'm gonna stalk her plane all the way to Japan. Because that's where she's going. So, yay! Say hi! Yeah. She has landed in Hong Kong International uh, Airport. <laughs> yep, here is my password and Ooh. my um, flying tickets. I'm currently um, waiting for another flight at 8 a.m. 8.45. Yeah, here yeah, right, correct me. <laughs> I'm stalking her. Uh, now we're just looking for food. Uh, I don't know what else to say. I'm a little late because uh, it was glitching out a little bit, but there's her second flight on its way to Tokyo, Japan. She uh, she just left uh, uh, Hong Kong International Airport, and there she is right there. So uh, I'm assuming here in a minute because Hong Kong is that way uh, that the plane's going to do a U-turn. Here in a second, I'm assuming. So yeah, um, I've pretty much been stalking her. Uh, this screen has been up since she left her house uh, about nine hours ago. Oh, look at that! It's doing a U-turn. Okay, so anyways, um, I'm gonna be keeping an update for you guys as to what her what her uh, progress is, if anybody's interested at all. But yeah, she's going to be going to Disneyland and 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 a whole bunch of places. See, I lost the signal. Stop moving. Oh, there it is. But anyways, yeah, I'll keep you guys updated. So, peace. Again, um it's been I don't know how many hours, but Eva is about 2 minutes away from landing in, in Tokyo, Japan, and so I thought I might as well show you the exact route that she took because I have it on the screen. So, that's where she started in Hong Kong. And she went right there. She's about ready to land, so I'm going to go ahead and zoom in on her landing. I've gotten pretty good at this map thing since I've been stalking her for the past six hours. Nah, obviously I did other things. It'd be kind of boring staring at the screen for five, six hours. But anyway, she's about to land. Uh, I'll start recording here in a minute when she gets close to the airport. There's the airport. She's in on approach about uh, 1,000 feet in the air or uh, 312 meters. And her speed is about 265 kilometers an hour, kilometers, kilometers, whatever. Uh, 161 miles per hour. But yeah, uh, now she's coming in for her approach right now. So I will get that when she actually decides to land. I think she's going for a roundabout. So a roundabout is where they go around the airport one time and then come in. Because uh, it, it could be because there's another plane in the area. But I have a filter so I can only see her. So anyways, yes. She's not coming on approach. She's going to be coming on this runway right here. That's the runway that she is currently running on. Or landing on right now. I didn't realize that she was going to land that easily. And it looks like she went off radar for a second when she... Oh, no, she's still there. Okay. And look at that, she's landing! Yay! She's at 300 feet, which she probably hit the runway by now, but... Yep, she's on the runway. She's at only about 155 miles an hour. And looks like... She's going to land. Maybe. Yay, she's slowing down. Okay, she's officially in Tokyo, Japan. Uh-oh. I hope so everything's okay, because she kind of went off the runway, but I don't know if that's because of her or what. Uh, where is she going? Oh. Haha, <laughs> I thought she crashed! Oh my god, that was creepy. Um, 
Yeah, it was just glitching out. It looks like she landed. Yay, she's safe. All right, now I can sleep easy. Uh, she'll probably be calling me here in about 20 minutes or so. So, uh, um, we'll see. We'll see her when she calls. Did and she's calling me. Oh, she's showing me the airport. The toilet. Is it clear? Uh, clear enough. <gasps> Look at the writing. It's not sunlight. Yeah. Okay, I'm getting to the uh, immigration place here. Immigrant? You're an immigrant. <laughs> <laughs> You're excited, huh? Mm -hmm. You're in a foreign country. You could be deported. <laughs> well, I actually, I actually have to get inside the um, the uh, trans uh, immigration first. Okay, I'll t I'll I'll talk to you later. Okay, I love you. Love you. I want to show you this. She is in Japan. That is... Uh-oh. I might be losing her. Oh, no. Tokyo, Japan. May your adventures be good. I don't know why I said that. Oh, no. I lost her. <laughs> yeah. but, uh, I'm at the bus and the bus has the Wi-Fi and it's so awesome because the hotel don't have a Wi-Fi. I'm screwed. All right, baby, say goodbye so you can start your adventures. Bye, see ya. That's that's it. Uh, the the entire bye. video led it up to you saying bye. Uh, see you later. So I I'm, I'm already in Japan and now I'm on the bus heading to the Tokyo station. Um, and it's actually my, my auntie's birthday today, so we're looking for a birthday cake. And yeah, I'm just at the bus waiting until I get there because it will be the last station that I will uh, arrive to. So I hope you guys enjoy watching it. <laughs> Hey baby, make a crazy face for the thumbnail. Okay. <laughs> if you're interested in hearing more about us, click anywhere on the screen to subscribe.